up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here of Marty Music. Thanks so much for hanging out for another lesson, another heavily requested tune. We've got uh, American Pie, which, you know, one of those classics. It's kind of like, now that I broke it down, it's like take every beginner chord and put them in as many different combinations as you can think of. But it is still all nice, easy beginner chords. And it's a super long, there's so many verses. But anyway, we'll break down a, a chords, rhythm, the whole thing for you. Also, thank you uh, so much for subscribing right here and spreading the word on Marty Music. Really appreciate that continued support. Thanks so much. Uh, let's get to it. Here we go. All right. So the first thing I'm going to show you is the chorus because it's the thing that's most familiar with this song. Uh, then there's basically two other chord progressions to learn. There's the intro and there's the verse. So let's get with that chorus, though. We're going to play a G chord. And then we're going to play a C chord. And then we're also going to need a D chord. And that's all you need for the chorus, but it goes like this. G, C, G, D, G, D, G, G, D, C, C, but the G, 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 D. minor to a7 d minor now d7 and it goes and it rocks out everybody's having a good time okay let's do it again so and you can just start with the kind of straight thing it speeds up way later but we got down down up 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 g c Minor rings out, and then A7 is just like an A major chord, but with the open G string in there. I use my middle and ring finger. You could use these two. And then E minor rings out. And then D7 is what I saw a video of, of the guy doing it, Don McLean. But anytime you have a seven chord, you can play a regular major and it's still gonna work. But so then we have D7. Then eight goes into rock and roll. Yeah, yeah. Okay, but we gotta do the intro, which is uh, the chords just kind of ring out and it's a little story. We're telling a little story. And in the song, there's gonna be two walk downs that, that happen quite a bit. One is G down to E minor, and you can do it like this, G, and then you could just hit that second fret E string by itself, but I think the best thing is G and then D over F sharp. So the thumb is on the second fret of the low E while I hold a D chord. If you can't do that, a regular D chord is going to work. But it's nice to get that walk down bass. The other thing that's going to happen is a C down to A minor. C, and to go down to A minor, you just take your middle finger and hit that second fret of the A, and then A minor. So you have G down to E minor, and you're also going to have C to A minors. So just keep that in mind because that happens. Both of those little movements happen throughout the song. All right, so let's start with the intro. It's a G walk down to E minor, so and I'll count them out. One, two, three, four. So G, D over F sharp, E minor. So one, two, three, four. Then A minor for two, C for two. One, two, three, four. Then E minor to D. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So that D rings out for six counts. So check it out. One, two, three, four. A minor, two, C, two. 
E minor, two, D, two, one, two, three, four. And it almost does the same thing again, but instead, uh, there's a little change. So now it does that G to E minor walk down. G, D, E minor, four, A minor, two, C, two, E minor, two, but now C, two, D, two, three, four. So let me do that from the top. This is the intro. G, D, E minor, four, A minor, two, C, two, E minor, two, D, two, one, two, three, four, and then again. G, D, E minor, two, A minor, two, C, two, E minor, but now C, to D. Here's the next section, E minor to A minor, E minor to A minor. So, E minor to A minor, E minor to A minor. Now we do that C, walk down to A minor. C, walk down A minor, C to D to G, walk down to E minor C2 D2 G walk down to E minor the day C the music then G 2 3 4 the rings out rings out into the chorus I taught you Right? Okay, so now with the chords in front of you, I'm going to play that intro. And this is a good spot to, uh, I don't know if you can bookmark a video, but this is a good spot to kind of practice along with this section. Here it is. I'm just going to play it. Three, four. And when that D's ringing out, I forgot to mention this. When the D's ringing out, you can do the little, the little uh, song candy. Okay, so here it is again. Intro three, four. walk down to A minor. So now it speeds up and we got to learn the verse and there's really nothing new to learn, but it's a more rocking, fast strumming kind of thing for the rest of the song. So here's the strum pattern. Down, down, up, up, down, up, oh, Mickey, you're so fine, you're so fine, you blow my mind. Down, down, up, up, down, up, 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 down, up, up, down, up, down, up, up, down, up. And 
And so this is, uh, the, here are the verses. It's all the same chords and a different combination, but we're going to start with G for a bar, meaning four counts, A minor. These are all one bar, and then C, then A minor, then E minor, and then D for two bars, meaning eight counts. So check it out. G, two, three, four, A minor. A minor, E minor, D, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So that's the first line of the verse. Then we do the G walk down to E minor. So G, D, E minor, A minor, C, E minor, A7, real slow. So that second line is G, D, E minor, A minor for a bar, C for a bar, E minor for a bar, A7 for a bar, and then D for two bars. So now the verse from the very beginning. Here we go. G, A minor, C, A minor, E minor. Now we're going to let an E minor ring out and a D ring out and then an E minor ring out and a D ring out. So Okay, that's easy. And then the C walk down to A minor. And then a C for a bar. Now there's one more line before it goes to the chorus. And it's a G walk down to E minor. And then a C. G walk down to E minor again. C, D, G, C, G, D. I'm singing bye bye. So very. So it kind of does the little bit of the chorus as the end of the verse into the chorus. So that last line of the verse, G, D, E minor, A minor, C, G, D, E minor, C, two, three, four, D, two, three, four, G, C, G, D, the chorus. Bye, bye, Miss America, bye. Okay, so. Down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. And we're going to do that verse now. Here we go. The chords are there. So follow along. One, two, three, four. that chorus so now and the chorus is very straightforward so we don't need that written out but uh now let's do the intro to the chorus to the verse to the chorus and you can play along with me and then that's the lesson so here's the intro one two here we go
Knew the chorus. And we're singing. E minor to A7. E minor to D7. Now the D7, we speed up and we go into that verse. Here we go, G. And so if you just re go through that form about for about 35 minutes, that would be the song. That's how many verses it seems like. Um, <laughs> um, anyway, though, that this is one of those things where you've got lots of easy chords, but lots of little variations. So, um, you know, hopefully the little chord symbols I put up help you. And uh, that's it for now. So bye bye. Good old American Pie. All right, thanks again. Hope you uh, enjoyed the tune. Uh, also, I appreciate that continued support, you know, getting the word out on Marty Music. I've got uh, all kinds of new videos coming just about every day and other cool surprises that are still coming. Uh, you know, I just want to give you guys everything you want and make the best guitar destination possible that I can humanly make. Um, I guess that's it for now. I just want to say... Uh, have a great one and keep playing and keep uh, staying inspired. See you later.